Hello, everybody. Mike Arnold here, co-founder of Path Training Partners, along with Bob Iacchino. Updated all the key GAN levels right now. So what are we looking for today? Inside range. So when you have an inside range day, what we watch for is the day, the outside range day, which was Friday, the key high and key low for a bullish and bearish patterns. So above which also the key high is right near the 25% gain retracement. So we'll watch for that. So above about 247, start watching. Then the next target area is around 253 to 255. And through that, remember, we saw that old trend line and some key areas. But what we'll be watching for is the upper end of the rotation zone, 263. So if we had a really strong, and this isn't just for tomorrow, but if we had a really strong rally or a stronger rally, taking us back to just above the prior key swing low we'd be watching for really about 255 to 263 in there to the upside a downside intermediate level now 223 first level support then we have a major three-way cluster down between about 212 and 215 so on another rotation back down 212 to 215 is going to be the key levels we're still not out of our oversold condition, but approaching it in, and there's no still longer term bottoming pattern yet. So we're gonna have to base it off the interday price action of bullish case again above about 247, bearish case below 231. Remember, this can, as I talked about on the update, the weekly wrap up, two ways we can take us out of this oversold condition. We can either rally back to the rotation zone or we drift sideways. You know, and which we've already, this is technically a drift sideways because we're an inside bar until the rotation zone comes down and catches up. And then we'll watch for the next break lower. So we have for you on Tesla today and we'll talk to everyone later. Bye for now.